is it when it comes to getting the freshest fruits and veggies grown right here in Michigan. And you can get the freshest at the Tuesday market at Eastern Market. So what should be on your shopping list? Michelle Oliver is live. Hey, Michelle, I understand that there was a double yoke situation there three times in a row. Really? Yeah, yes, there was. When she was making the frittata before, one, two, three eggs, all double yolk. It was kind of crazy. But let's talk about the fresh produce that's here right now. I'm here with Justin Crawl with So Fresh Farms. That's S-O-W, Fresh Farms. So what's behind the name? Well, um, really what we were trying to convey is the concept of taking the seeds and sowing them in the spring and then coming out with a bountiful harvest of different uh, produce. So that was kind of the concept behind that. Great. And what is in season right now? It looks like everything. Yes. August is a great month in Michigan for homegrown produce. Um, a lot of things are on. I mean, you have all your fruiting vegetables like your tomatoes, peppers. You've got a lot of your melons that have come on. Um, greens, corn, squash, zucchini. So really a shopper can get lots of different things at the market. That's great. And now your farm is a little different than everybody else's. Everybody has their own story. Tell us about yours. Well, we're a fourth generation farm, but um, over the years, we've kind of modified our farm a bit and went from grain to more produce related. Uh, we have a farm market in Adrian, Michigan, and we grow a lot of produce for that. And then we also come to places like the Eastern Market to sell our, our produce. And you work on this with your whole family, right? Yes, we, it's a family endeavor. Um, we opened up our year-round market three years ago, and um, it's really, that was kind of the big thing, is just getting the family involved and um, working together to accomplish you know, some goals. So. so what's coming in really well this year? What do you have a lot of? Um, corn for us on our farm is always a big one, um, and tomatoes. And we really try to grow a variety since we have a farm market. We try to offer people a lot of things that they won't typically get in a grocery store. Different kinds of zucchini and squash, different kinds of eggplants and things like that. So that's kind of the advantage when they come out to a place like Easter Market. They can find things that they may not see at their grocery store. That's great. That's why you need to come down here. And they are open until 3 p.m. today. The rain's starting to let up, so it's time for you to come down and join us after the show. Jason and Tati, back to you. Thanks, Michelle. That produce looks beautiful. Doesn't it look like she's being attacked by giant eggplants? A little in the, bit. In the foreground. <laughs> and Michelle, um, before your next hit, I want you to go find the most unusual thing that you could show on camera from the market. The most unusual. That, that is your mission. Do you accept it? All right. Challenge accepted, Jason.